Hi guys, how are we all? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all well. Um, excuse the absolute nick of me, I have zero. And I mean no tan on. None. There's none on my body. I am pasty white. Um, but I just thought I would jump on because um, I mean, this video is going to be really relaxed, really casual. It's basically like an updated hair care chat. Um, and I'm going to put my skincare on while I'm on talking so I can kind of talk you through what I've been using at the moment. Um, before I start, I'm not a pro, okay? Like, I'm not a pro. I'm just talking off experience recently. Um, I need to open my window two seconds. Um, I'm just talking off experience recently. Um, and what I have found really works for me. Um, obviously, you guys know I was, during lockdown, was such, like, a massive hair care journey for me. Like, I feel like I, um really learned like what hair care was um and I'm someone who really like see if something's worth it I will spend the money and I've always been very generous when it comes to skincare um and making sure I'm using the right stuff but when it came to hair care I kind of thought it's a bit of a con it's like one of those things hair is just trying to sell you shit however I could not be more wrong hair care is just as important as skincare um so I'm not going to repeat myself too much or try not to anyway. Um, if you do, if you're just watching this video for the first time, you're like, wait, what is she talking about? Um, on my channel, there are other videos where I start off with tapes and I have no tapes. And I'm back to no tapes at the moment. Um, so yeah, please go back and watch them if you kind of want to know a little bit more. Um, but obviously, I'll quickly recap. I have an underactive thyroid, which is quite commonly you have hair loss. Um, I also have... Well, it was kind of brought on by stress, alopecia, and I was losing clumps and like big patches of my hair. Um, and I would say now, they're all gone, apart from the one here that's still slightly, um, a little bit patchy, but nowhere near as noticeable as what it once was. Um, so yeah, I just thought I would make this a really casual video, nothing super serious. And just kind of talk you through. Now I've left my eye cream in my car because I just did my mum's makeup there. And I took it with me and I don't think I've got a spare eye cream on me. So I'm going to just do it without eye cream but I'll add that stage later. Um, so I'm first of all going to go in with my, I use the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Serum. And I, I also use the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Eye Cream. Um, now, I don't know if I'm doing all these wrong stages, but I want them all on the skin, so hopefully they'll do the same thing. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd make this video super casual. Like, it's Saturday night, I have no plans tonight, I'm on my own. And I just thought, do you know what, I'll just film it and get it done. Um, there is going to be a clip where I actually demonstrate using hair care products and all that and like what my hair's like. I filmed that a couple of days ago when I was washing my hair. Um, because one thing I've learned is not washing your hair often. Um, is actually better for your hair. Like I used to wash my hair every single day. Every single day. Now I wash it twice a week. Um, do I put moisturiser or oil on first? I'm never really sure. I think I'll do moisturiser. Is your moisturiser last? Or does your oil go on last? I feel like I'm trying to do this right, but I don't really know what I'm doing. I feel like that would be too thick, so I'll do oil first. Oh my god, people are going to come for me. Guys, I don't know what I'm doing, if I'm honest. Oil, oh my god, guys, get this face oil. It is the best stuff ever. Um, but, yeah, I just thought I would kind of do like a wee catch up because I would say religiously for the last six months, I have used the same products religiously. Like, I haven't changed them. And I honestly see a difference. Now, what I will say is, I don't know if it's one product that's get, it's doing a difference or if it's them all combined. Um, however, I am just kind of using them all and I'm going to continue to use them all. 
Also guys, none of this video is an ad. No one's asked me to do this. I'm not paid to do it and no one has gifted me. It's all paid for. Um, the only thing that's kind of, not an ad, but because I buy from them and I talk about it to use, they give me a discount code to use, but I'm also allowed to give you the discount code. So it's Eternal Youth. Um, but like apart from that, like they don't pay me. So like, apart from that, like there's kind of nothing really like, do you know what I mean? <laughs> um, so yeah, I have been using these products for about six months religiously and I can hand on heart say they work. Um, if any of these products you have similar at home, so if I'm like talking about Moroccan oil and you've got fucking something oil, it's, it does the same job then great. Um, because it might seem like you're buying a lot, but when you buy this once, guys, it will last you months. And I'm talking like six months. Like I just ran out of something the other day and that's me used it for six months now. Um, so it might seem like a big spend when you divide it how, 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 over however many months and how amazing your hair will feel. Um, like I don't know if you can really tell a difference um, in my hair. Um, but this is my hair with no extensions. I know it doesn't feel look very thick, maybe the now, but it actually is quite thick. Like the amount of people recently have been saying to me, oh, have you get extensions back in? And I'm like, no. And they're like, oh my God, I can't believe all that's like your own hair. Um, so like, you can definitely tell there's more hair there than what there was before. Like it does feel super heavy. Um, and I'm absolutely loving it and I will never get extensions again. Um, I do have clip-ins. They are the wrong colour, however, but I'm going to tone them. But they're just if I want to go like really, really glam one night and I'm wanting really thick hair or whatever. Um, but I, to be fair, I haven't actually worn them yet because they are the wrong colour. Um, so yeah, basically I've been doing this for six months, like I've said. Um, I'm now just going to buy me with a skin food moisturiser. Um, I kind of neglected my skin, no joke, for about a solid month, but I was neglecting my diet. I neglected everything. Um, and I just feel like I needed a really thick moisturiser again, so I went back to my skin food. But for a good few months there, and I still am using it during the day, is the Charlotte Tilbury Day Cream. I only wear this one because it's like half six at night and I'm not obviously going anywhere, so I can kind of lay this on thick. Um, but yeah, I just thought I would kind of run through kind of what I use and things like that and pop up some photos. Um, I hand on heart believe that the Eternal Youth has really, really, really improved me um, in the sense of like hair care and skin care. And the reason why I know it works, my brows are the thickest I've ever been, not right now because they're like pulled across, but um, it's the most brow hair. My own nails are so, so strong. Oh, sorry Mia are so so strong my skin's the best it's ever been and um, there's so many factors in how i just feel good and um, my lashes this is the first time and no joke guys about five years i've went without lash extensions like i get lash extensions every two weeks and um, and now i feel like i don't need them because my lashes are so good and it is literally down to tell you because that's only been since i started using that um and i feel like people who do with my brows and my lashes and stuff like that um have been like oh my god like you can tell you can tell there's a, a cream or something there no no um you can pure tell a difference so this is eternal youth here so i'll pop up my discount code now it's basically a shot you can either just shot it and um, put it in your morning drink or whatever it is um i sometimes just put it in my ice latte if i'm on the go um recently because i am trying to eat a calorie deficit i've been having protein shakes i just put my shot in with my protein shake um, but I'm not going to lie guys, see if you keep it in the fridge, you can just tan it um, and it's amazing. It's also super affordable as well I feel um, but it does everything, it kind of works from within out so it just helps your skin, it's full of vitamins um, and that's the thing, see especially with your skin, yes skincare is amazing but I do feel that with skin sometimes you need something that's going to work from within out and I feel like that's what Eternal Youth does. Same with my hair. Like all my breakages have now grew to the length of my normal hair. Um, and basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a photo of my hair before I got my tapes in, right? And then I'm going to show you a photo of my hair when I got my tapes out. Now the problem was because when I had tapes in, the cut that I got cut all my own hair to give it a style with tapes. But then when I took my tapes out, my own hair was like, like it was a riot. Um, 
So I went to Florence and Florence was like, I need to cut your hair. And I was like, no, 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 I don't want you to cut it. And she was like, I need to, we need to get the dead ends off. Um, and what I'll do is I will show you a photo of my hair from the back. If you look closely, you can see there's bits of my hair. And it was all basically more around the front. Like you can kind of still tell, even like the now, like those bits are different lengths. Do you see what I mean? So that's going to take a process. I now need to regrow them. But when I got my hair cut and kind of bluntly and kind of brought to more like the one length, like even these bits, guys, see since Florence has done my hair, what a difference because they were pretty short. Um, and that is just me using my products. So I kind of want to just talk you through what I use and why I use it in my routine, basically. Um, so Eternal Youth is part of my everyday, every morning routine. I take it as I take it alongside my thyroid tablet. So if you're someone that's on maybe the contraceptive pill or something like that, or you take tablets in the morning, then it's a great addition just to add to it. Apart from anything else, it's just full of really good vitamins. So I feel like for your, your immune system and things like that, it's just good to have. Um, so that's Eternal Youth. So my routine is I usually wash my hair on a Wednesday and I wash my hair on a Sunday. Um, however, if I'm out at the weekend, I don't want to do the Sunday wash. I do the wash um, either the, usually the Saturday. And then again, that means it's longer till the Wednesday. But I most of the time do wash my hair on a Wednesday because it's the day that I take all my photos. Um, so what I tend to do is the night before, on a, so on a Tuesday night, I do my Olaplex. So I'm sure it's number three. I've got it over there. Um, hold on, I'm maybe actually So this is it here, it's Olaplex number three. Now you kind of just want to get like, if you're not washing your hair, what I kind of have is like a bottle that you can just spray water. Spray your hair so it's damp and put this on. Now I put this on from like the top to the bottom. Then I put on this, where is it? I've just seen it, it's there. Then I put on, um, this is from Holland and Barrett. It is castor oil, organic for your hair and your skin. Um, now, if you suffer from patches of hair or hair loss or, um, now I don't know if it works for so much for like breakages where you've still got long parts of your hair, but I basically put this all around my hairline where a lot of my hair was coming out in patches and I have a patch at the back of my head and Lee would like kind of pat it on the back of it. Um, and I've noticed majorly, even when I was getting a blow dry the other day, it was like, oh my God, you've got loads of little short bits of hair here. And I was like, oh my God, is my hair snapped? And she was like, no, that's fresh hair. Like, this is new hair. There was no colour on it. And it was quite strong. Um, and I think it's just been from the patches at the front of my head with the castor oil. That's really helped the growth, if you know what I mean. So what I do is I put my Olaplex on. I take my castor oil, do it round my hairline and comb it through. And then put it on in other places. And then I kind of just run my hands to the end. Twirl it and put it in a high top bun. So then I wash my hair the next day. And when I wash my hair, I wash my hair with Olaplex shampoo and Olaplex conditioner. Um, again, guys, when I say you might think, oh, that's a lot of money, right? When I say you need the size of a, not even a 10 pence piece, a pound, right? You need the tiniest, tiniest, tiniest amount of shampoo. It froths up so much so you get it all over your hair. I absolutely love it. So I use the shampoo, I use the conditioner. Then when I come out, in the next slide you're going to see all the products that I use when I come out the shower. Now like I've seen that, that clip, I'm unsure if one of them works or if they all work. However, I haven't bought any of them in six months um, and I really do love them. I feel like they all benefit my hair. And I feel like people kind of think, oh heat protectors, I've got a shite or oil, I've got a shite. But like guys... I have noticed a difference and I think as well, even other people notice a difference, like people that have been washing my hair or doing my blow dries or my friends are like, oh my god, your hair's so soft. Like the condition and the actual health of my hair is 10 times better. So I do this on a Wednesday, then continue all my steps. Then when I wash, wash my hair at the weekend, I use the Keratis shampoo and conditioner, which I'm going to show you. So I've not got the, thing Coco, I've not actually got the shampoo on me that's actually in the shower, but I've got two conditioners, so I'll show you when it's not opened. Um, and it's this stuff here. Now, my mum and dad actually bought me a gift set and it was for blondes. So it was kind of like version on like purple shampoo vase, which is also very good. Um, but this is the one I use. So one, 
wash is Olaplex wash, one wash is a Keratis wash. Um, this product, read the reviews on it guys, is amazing. So I use the shampoo and the conditioner. Um, so I use that once a week and then I use the Olaplex once a week. And honestly guys, I feel like they all work. I feel like really looking into shampoos majorly major like will make a difference like there's so many shampoos and conditions out there that have all these big tv adverts but they're fucking shocking for your hair um and do you know what i've learned a lot about hair care tiktok like during lockdown i was like just hashtag tiktok uh, hashtag hair care and i was watching every video i mean i don't else do my time obviously um but i was just like really invested in learning about hair um so that is really good shampoo and conditioner if you think the older place is a little bit out of your budget, completely understand. This isn't cheap either. It's not like a couple of pounds. You can get a gift set, but again, guys, it means a good size bottle. You need the smallest amount. Um, so it will last. Um, so they're like my two week, that's like my twice a week wash. The products that I use when I get out, I'm going to talk, I kind of talk through when I'm kind of doing it in the other clip, but I'll quickly go over it. Moroccan oil is like my favourite oil. Um, Olaplex oil is good, but I don't know. I just feel like Moroccan oil is known for the oil and I really do like it. Um, the heat spray that I use is a Beauty Works one. And the reason why is when I had extensions, I feel like it was better. However, I just continue to use it and I do really, really like it. Um, and also the Lee Stadford stuff, guys, is really, really affordable. So maybe have a look at that if you are looking to have some products. I use their leave-in conditioner which I absolutely love, but again, it's, it's probably one of the most affordable hair brands out there. Um, but yeah, the kind of purpose of this video was just like a little quick catch up, like to kind of show you my hair in the natural light. And I have had it coloured, like people were like, oh, you're not scared of it going more blonde again in case it snaps your hair. I feel like if you go to the right person, your hair shouldn't snap. That's just my opinion. Um, but hair care is such a major thing. And I know... People think, oh, it's just extra money and it's a lot of money, but it's an investment, really. It's an investment in your hair. And honestly, guys, this is the first time I've just had to go replenish a product and that's six months later, if not more. Um, so yeah, I'll pop up like photos of my hair now. Like recently on my Instagram photos, is just my natural hair. I don't wear extensions. Um, but yeah, I'm going to pop these on to the next clip of me actually using some of the products. Um, I hope I'm not blabbed too much, but I just... I, all the questions I get like daily on my DMs are but can we get up more info on your hair? Can we get this? Can we get that? And it just thought it'd be easier just to put it all in a video and just kind of have a really relaxed chat. Not like a pure, like a big video, like it won't be a big watch, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, hopefully this is good. Please watch the next clip that's coming up. This is kind of me using the product. Um, but next week there's like me packing for London. Um, I've got a haul next week. Um... I'm actually also trying on the clothes where we pack for London, so it's like kind of two hauls basically. There'll be a vlog of London, all that type of stuff. Um, the following week. So yeah, thank you for watching. Any questions, guys, let me know. I'm going to pop the link for every single thing down below. I'll also pop a discount code down below for Eternal Youth. Any questions, feel free to ask me down below or on in Instagram. Um, but yeah, I hope you're having a really good weekend. I'm having such a boring weekend, but... Hey ho, I'm actually trying to stay off the drink and eat really well and all that kind of shit. Really boring, no one really wants to know. Um, but yeah, I hope you all have a lovely weekend. Happy Sunday. Um, I love Island tonight, it's all going to kick off. Um, but yeah, any feedback you want to give me, please let me know. And yeah, have a good weekend. And I'll see you on Wednesday for Pack With Me slash haul slash have a fucking mental breakdown if nothing fits. So stay tuned for the next clip. Hi guys, so I actually wasn't going to film this bit just now for the hair care but I've just washed my hair and I don't really plan on washing it for a good couple of days now so because of when I want this video clip I'm going to just do it now. So I just thought, oh my boobs out, I just thought I would quickly run through what products um, I use on my hair. I know I've obviously chatted a bit before this video. Um, but I just thought I would show you like basically my hair wash routine. Pro showed you previously, so obviously this is my hair, I'm just out of the shower. Like, I haven't washed my hair in days, it's been up slick back for like four days now. So it needed like a lot of more treatment. 
So I did the Olaplex just in the shower there on my shampoo and my conditioner. Um, and yeah, so now I'm going to do like my hair. Two seconds. I have used these products, like I was saying, religiously. Like, I don't change them. It's my go-to. I don't know if it's one it's working or if they're all working. But at the moment, I'm not going to be changing. Like, I'm going to just stick to what I know with it. So, first of all, with my hair like this, before I brush it, I go in with the Lee Stadford um, Activation Leave-In Treatment. Now, I got this in a PR box. Lee Stadford. It's Hair Apology. 10 in 1 leave in treatment spray. This is an activation leave in treatment. So, this is for intensive care. So, either or, but I've been using this one. Like, obviously, you can see it's basically done. So, a couple of sprays on each side. And then to get a brush through my hair, I go in with the Moroccan oil, um, all in one leave in conditioner. And I'm not gonna lie, guys, like I wouldn't be able to get a brush through my hair without it. Then I just take like a big paddle and just brush my hair at this stage. Since having like my hair cut like so basically i got all obviously i was telling you guys i got my tapes out um and my hair was all different lengths like it was kind of tragic um and then i went and got my hair colored and the girl florence was like i know you really want to grow your hair she's like but at the back it's shocking like it really does need cut so we did basically cut the ends to one length there is a fly flying about i can't get it out of the fucking house um and basically um since then my hair has grew rapid it lo instantly looked thicker it instantly felt better and um, when i was styling it it was sitting better just everything so guys if you are debating like where or not to get all your dead ends off just do it um i did say to florence take off the minimum that it kind of needs don't go too short but no joke within like one or two weeks like my hair was growing rapid and i've even noticed like all my front bits because basically we're trying to get all the bits that are super short now to grow to the one length. So now what I go in with is this colour wow wall extra large bombshell volumizer. Now I usually think these things are pretty shit. I think it's just a pure con. Wow wow wow. This is night and day. So give it a good shake. Give it this much. Rub it in your hands. And then because I want the volume at the top. Now the good thing with this is I was really sceptical the first time putting this on. I actually did it a day that I had no plans for a couple of days. So if my hair was greasy, I wasn't bothered. Um, it doesn't make your hair greasy, even though you're applying it straight to your root, which is mental. Um, and then just really massage that in. And honestly, guys, like see now when I wash my hair and I just leave it straight, it's got like volume at the root, even like days later my hair still got volume. So that's me so far, I use my leave-in um, activation treatment. I've used my leave-in conditioner and I've used my volumizer. Um, now, this, I think it's changed bottle, um, but I, basically what happened was I worked with Beauty Works at one point and I had a few PR packages and then I remember I bought up something, I got a free gift. Then I bought another bundle of something I got in our free gift and it was like basically this. So I've had loads of these to run through. This is my last, I don't know if you can, there's really nothing in it. This is my last one. So it's basically the 10 in 1 miracle spray. So if it's not in this bottle, don't panic, it'll be the same thing. This is like basically heat spray. Um, Cause I don't actually have just a on its own heat spray. Um, this Beauty Works one has in it for me. Um, now on days where I'm not doing like big Olaplex treatment or see the days where I've done my Olaplex treatment the night before, I would go in with my number six Bond Smoother and my Olaplex oil. 
but I didn't do that last night. I only did the shampoo and conditioner. So maybe like midweek this week, I'll do a treatment the night before I wash my hair and then I'll put this in the day after. But basically I just go in with the Moroccan oil and I'm talking guys, a drip, like a dribble. Massage it and I always divide my hair. And I just make sure I really run it through because you don't want to have like one part of the hair that's got more oil because I've done that before. Um, and to be honest, I kind of mainly focus this on the ends of my hair because that's probably where the most damage is. Um, but yeah, obviously guys, you don't need to buy all of these. If you've got also a similar brand or similar product at home, then you don't have to jump out and buy the ones I'm using, buy what's in your budget. I do recommend these four. Oops. I do not wash my hair without it. If I go on holiday, these big bottles go. If I go to London for a night, I think I could possibly wash my hair. These big bottles go. Um, I have now used them for months. Like I can get up the copy of my receipt from when I bought this. Um, I'll pop it up on the screen if I can find it. Um, literally like this is like my 10th bottle it's nearly done this is amazing and obviously this now you look fantastic sell these um, and you can get this in like a little care package where it comes with other products as well um, so now what I would just do is I would just go in and um, dry my hair so I'm going to do that and then I will show you what my hair is like dry um but obviously before i've showed you before and after photos so far hi guys i've already showed you kind of like before and after photos of my hair um and the difference all these products do make um so let's dry my hair So hair is now dry, so I just thought I would bring it all to the front. Now you may be thinking my hair looks, I don't know, someone said my hair looks really dry. <laughs> um, this whole section here was really badly damaged, so this is a bit I'm trying to grow out. I don't know if you can kind of see at the bottom. It's not in the best condition compared to the rest of my hair. Now I've just kind of banged a wee roll on the top just to give it a wee flick out on my bangs. Um, but like my hair is so soft, like I can run my hands all through it. Um, I don't know if you guys can tell, but the thickness of my hair is so much fuller. Like there's so much more hair now um, and it's in just so much better condition. Um, so I don't really have much plans today for my hair. I think I'm going to just basically quickly run over the straighteners and curl it under the bottom. Um, but yeah, I just thought I would kind of show you like the products I actually use and like how I quickly use them. Um, I know it seems like a lot of money, but, um, or it seems like maybe you're buying a lot of stuff, but honestly guys, you're not. Like once you buy it, you will not need to buy it for months and months and months, like no joke. Um, again, like it depends how many times you're using them. If you're only washing your hair once or twice a week, then great. Um, then you'll be like me, you won't need to buy them all the time. Um, but I highly recommend them. I can't tell you if one works more than the other because I kind of have been using them now all for the same amount of time. Um, and I absolutely love all of them. Um, so I do recommend them all. Um, of course, if you have something similar at home, then just use that. But I think the key and the secret to all of this, which I have kind of learned, and that was all via lot like from lockdown, is um like I don't you can't really see it in the camera, but there's so much volume at the root now. Like even here, like all the hair's not stuck to my head the way it would usually be. Um, which kind of makes you feel like your hair is thicker anyway. Um but 
what was I saying there? Yeah, I basically learned in lockdown just purely for the simple fact I had nothing else to do in my time. Um, is that you kind of have to be religious with something like you have to keep using it um, to see the results you're not going to see results with hair or skin care and like that within a couple of days um, like it really has to be something that you use more than once and kind of constant um, and I can honestly say that is probably the only thing in my life that I actually stick to <laughs> and do um, and it is my hair care and my skin care um, but honestly guys the difference in my hair since using all these products is mental and even like now when I'm going for blow dries or like I'm out and about people are like oh for still get extensions in and I'm like no it's just my hair and they're like oh my god like your hair looks so much better like I went for a blow dry um, to the place I went to that I hadn't been since I got my tapes out and she was like I honestly cannot believe your hair um, she was like the difference in like six weeks um, and that is genuinely, I don't think it's been six weeks, maybe like four or five weeks um, since just kind of getting the tapes out and getting my hair cut and just kind of keep using all these products. So basically, um, I do like an Olaplex treatment once a week where the night before I put it on um, and I just really make sure that I really treat my hair and then any time that my hair is like slicked back um, if I know I'm going to kind of slick it back for a couple of days I just go back in with the ordinary oils that were in my previous hair care video um, what I'll do is I'll just get the links for them and I'll pop them down below but if you kind of want to see how I use them then it is in my previous hair care videos um, like I never put my hair up like slick rick without all those oils in my hair because I just don't see the point. I think it also stops your hair from breaking when it's in the bobble. Um, so yeah, I definitely noticed a massive difference. Um, and yeah, I'm super happy with my hair at the moment and I'm hoping maybe this time next year my hair will be super long. That is the aim of the game. Hopefully this has kind of helped. Um, I know you guys have kind of been asking like what is the, like, the stuff I've been using religiously but um, oh, it's down. I do believe that all this works and the thickness and the health of my hair is so much better. I'll take this wee bit down just so you can see what I mean. I don't know if this works but because I don't do it my usual way but we'll try. But yeah, I'm going to go do my skincare now, but I hope this wee video has helped. It's not a super long one, but I just thought it was super helpful for anyone kind of who's either followed me on, and this lighting's not the best, but it's really dull outside, who's either followed me on this hair care journey, um, or who just really wants advice on it. Um, and then I thought it would just be helpful to do like an updated um, version. Um, but yeah like and please comment please subscribe if you haven't already if you're sharing to instagram please tag me you know guys i always love that um but yeah hopefully you guys can see a difference in my hair um like i just think the health of it looks better um but yeah thank you guys for watching and any questions you guys know you can always ask me but i'll see you for the next one